Let's see. So you have access to probably the Huntress, Commando, Huntress and Multi. multi? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I don't remember how you get all the other ones. Some are harder than others. Complete 30 stages for engineering perfection. I imagine that's probably the engineer. Yep. 30 stages. Well, there. Just a certain amount of time is what that one is. I'm going to play the Huntress. The ability to not have to aim. Sounds like it might be beneficial for me as I get used to the game. Uh, throwing Seeking Glaive. Teleport in the sky. Rain arrows down below. Okay. That seems pretty cool. Do you want to play on the, the same difficulty or pop it down? It's up to you. you. Uh, so... I I don't really expect to win at all whenever I play this game, so the difficulty almost doesn't matter to me. Sure. Uh, all right. Let's see. Yeah, let's, let's, do, let's do one more on this, and then if we get bodied, or if we die earlier or at the same sort of point, maybe we'll pop it down one just to see what it's like. Yeah, the other difficulty is objectively easier they all kind of play the same it's just one scales harder than the other and uh the easier difficulty gives you more health regen okay Ooh, a blink it's actually quite nice let's see bouncy blade Okay, seeking. Every, so everything I got is basically seeking. Okay, that I like that. I like that for right now. Neat. New main going pro. I Huntress ha, is generally the character that I focus on. I don't. They changed this level. Uh, Huntress is the one that I usually use. Uh, was my main one back when I played Risk of Rain one a bunch, just because the mobility is such a massive like change of pace. Mm -hmm. Oh, I didn't actually bring the uh, the mobile ones. Eh, it's probably fine. Are you the engineer? Is that? Yeah, I decided I'd roll engineer this time. I do like how different the characters are. It's like oh, it's massive. Com yeah, compared to a lot of roguelikes, these characters are about as different as it gets for roguelikes' sake. Completely different move sets. I really, really like that. I bet you, I like. I could see myself getting like aggressively, aggressively into this. Ooh. It was one of those where I wanted to like it. I got really into it, but the the early access phase always is just such a downer. Yeah, I mean, it makes and it makes sense. Like, you know, I'm sure. It, 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 they, a lot of devs probably feel like almost obligated to do it. Oh, yeah, I, it's a great idea. It's yeah. just one of those where it's like, I am fatigued. It, you, you have dessert before dinner, and then you're supposed to enjoy your dinner. It's like, yep. And then it comes out for 1.0. You're like, it, that's like not eating dessert for months, and then you come back and have the dessert. That's what that's what I did. I'm like, I can tell I'm not going to feel good if I just keep playing this. I want to come back when I'm going to enjoy it more. Okay. By the way, uh, there are going to be some items that I'm probably going to earmark for you. But if you okay. see what looks to be a trio of mushrooms. Trio of mushrooms. Okay. Yep. Hey, I'm not finding much of anything on this. Like, chest-wise. I'm going to give yeah. one more cursory glance. But I might want to just get out of here. Yeah, I'm like, I'm not finding a ton of uh, nothing. I got a firework item that I thought would be cool, big boom, but is just like it's, sometimes when you touch stuff, fireworks it's come out. Busted good later on. Like if you get a bunch of those, uh, and you open anything, it'll just wipe the map. Okay. But on its own, eh, it's okay. All right, yeah, I'm not finding anything. I'm gonna go hit the boss teleporter and give me, please. <laughs> <laughs> Me? <laughs> I. It's an item. Forgive me. It's just an item called it's... "Forgive Me, Please." Yeah, you have it. Throw cursed doll that repeatedly triggers your on-kill effects. Oh, oh, that's what that's called, the voodoo doll. Oh, okay. Yeah. Is that right. is it new? It seems neat. Yeah. Oh. 
Alright. So, I, uh, I summoned two bosses instead of the usual one. On purpose? <laughs> yep. Yeah, Shrine of the Mountain. It makes you have items. more bosses spawn. The benefit is you get double boss loot. Okay. I might actually just, like, die, so I'm gonna run. I'm trying to run at the very least. Yeah. Just, just hide. Doing what I can. I see that the downside of this character is that you can't really uh, shoot from very far away. Ooh. That's the catch to the, to the insta-aim. I gotcha. Oh, boy. Yep, I died. I died. <laughs> I'm so bad. <laughs> Happens. Uh, let's see. Like this, this is definitely one of the few roguelikes where it is sometimes a toss-up on whether or not I actually make it out of the first level. For real? Okay. I mean, that makes me feel better. Oh, apparently I I lied. Also, apparently I had two and a half hours in the game. I just checked. <laughs> that makes more sense. That makes more sense. Okay. I actually have to care about this character. This is weird. Normally, I just uh, have super turrets, and I'm just dumping them everywhere, and it's great. I love that they, they throw the items like, like on the character. I love that you actually just have a teddy bear oh, yeah. to your back. That's yeah, really so, great. Uh, the soldier's syringe is always my favorite, because it's just a syringe sticking out of your arm. <laughs> it's like, that's, that's just unclean. No matter how you mm -hmm. shake that. Also, it's just like, you're just asking for trouble. You're going to bump into a rock. And it's just gonna it's gonna hurt like hell. So if you don't kill the boss by the time that Okay, nothing happens, okay. Yeah, nothing happens. It's just it's the only thing I'm fighting. But oh, did you buy a drone? I you did. did. <laughs> I'm helping from beyond the grave. It's 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 my gift to out. you. Are drones good purchases usually? Uh they're useful on the first, I'm gonna say like two to three levels, and then after a certain point they're kinda bad. Uh, okay. There is a Healy drone that you might want to keep an eye out for that is, like, objectively useful kind of at all times. Uh, the one thing is you do not... Uh, so if they get knocked down, you do not want to pick them back up again. Okay. Because they get they more expensive. They cost a lot of resources or something? Oh, yeah, okay. so the price actually goes up every time you uh, they go down. And so it's kind of worth it if you're totally swimming in money, but 90% of the time you want to save that cash uh, yeah. for item purchases. There she goes. Woo! I get book? A lot Chance of books. On kill to drop a treasure. Times three. Holy moly. All right. That's kind of nice. Treasures are like passive items? I, you know, I honestly have no idea. I've never seen this one before. I'm assuming it's just a uh, chance on kill to get an item. Big if true. But who knows? Big if true. I'm alive. Do I have, hey. does this character have less health or something i'm trying to yes. just like huntress okay. is definitively flimsier you're okay, supposed to make up for that by not having to be around enemies ah which is weird because you have to be closer to enemies than uh, the commando at least because otherwise oh because the lock on, on. yeah yeah you're right. you, have to be, you have to be pretty close to even lock on which is what i'm finding that i don't like currently i thought i would like her more until i found out how bad the range is now i'm i'll have to see I immediately have issues with my main. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll keep they an eye out for survivability items. Yeah, I'll also Let's keep see. an eye out. By the way, Healy drone over game. here. Uh, if you do want to pick one up, this is a decent floor for it. Okay. So it'll just follow you around healing. It might get distracted and heal me too. M maybe? That's all allowed. All allowed. Ooh. There's a treasure. Oh, is treasure just money? I mean, it's yeah. So it's whenever I kill too. anything, there will be little cash drops on the ground. Ooh. Wait, I want to see the syringe. Uh, let's see. It's I have a lot of them, in fact, and oh my God. in my yeah. thigh. Yeah. In the thigh. I. <laughs> I got big kicks.
Do you have any on kill effects? Do you want this? Oh yeah, hey. do you want this? Forgive me, please. Can I drop it somehow? Uh, you can if we find another use item. Okay. That actually wouldn't Let be a terrible idea. You get extra money. Yeah, I got another I one. I don't have any use of it yet. We'll see how this goes. If we're lucky, you benefit from the treasure. I hope yeah, so. Yeah, that'd be very cool. I keep getting phone calls and that. Like, my phone has been getting them so much that it literally just says, this is a scam. Like, it tells me. Nice. This is a scam. I've, like, not picked them up so often that I think they've just decided that they're scams. Because <laughs> I right. don't know how else they'd know. Uh, oh, well. I was going to give you the Sawmerang, but then I picked it up. That's okay. When we find one more. I only have one item. Uh, okay. Yeah. There. I need to. Uh, I need to stop yeah. picking up stuff. I haven't picked up anything terribly useful. I haven't picked up anything <laughs> at all. Period. <laughs> I got the. I, I got my rockets now. No, it's, yep. I'll. I just need to get to it quicker. There, I found something. This one's mine. That's. Uh, I also you do found know about the, the, uh, the altar. You do know about the sprint button, right? No, I found it oh. now. Okay. <laughs> I just wanted to make sure. It's like he knows that's a, that's a print. That's a pretty right? important one to to not yeah. know. So that's that's the reason why the huntress is actually useful. Uh, is because you can you can run forward and shoot while sprinting, whereas okay. every other character, uh, it's mutually exclusive. Turtle's survivability. Sure. Turtle. Temporary barrier, barrier on kill. Well, hey, I at least have an on kill now. Yep. Let's All right. See. That's another on kill, I think. I'm pretty sure. Yep. Killing enemies sets them on fire. Oh yeah, it's so so much better to have the sprint fun. Only this character has the sprint, or do ev does everybody have a version? Everybody of the has the sprint. You're just the, uh, you're the one that benefits the most from it. I'm the one that can fire while doing it. Okay. Correct. Okay. Gotcha. Yeah, that's yeah. Really so nice. if I if I want to start shooting while sprinting forward, I have to actually like stop and slow down and stuff. You don't have that limitation. Oops. Ooh, this got hairy. Oh. It also helps because it, it feels like the the blink has a little bit lower cooldown than the commandos thing. I think so. It feels like I, I think the commandos roll is the most common. Do you see this like uh, golden nugget on the ground? By the way. Mm. Oh well, yeah. you picked it up. Uh, yeah, sorry. I, did, I didn't realize it was going to absorb it to my body. It's yes. Fine. Is that okay. the treasure? Yep, that's treasure. I don't know if that's instance per player or not. Well, probably. I mean, I, I if I just stole yours, then I guess uh, that answers that. I just was not actually watching my own gold count to see if it actually helped. Oh, I see what you're saying. Uh, let's see. I'm going to do a quick peek for items and then probably pop the teleporter. Okay. Because we should get out of here. Offered a shrine of blood. <laughs> yeah, so that 70, that sacks your HP. Oh, okay. bustling fungus, yes. Oh, the three mushrooms. Okay. Yep, the three mushrooms. So uh, the three mushrooms specifically makes it so uh, if I'm not moving, I put down a Healy field around me, which is not particularly useful on me, but it's amazing my turrets that never move anywhere. Wait, so they get it too, or yep. just uh, my turrets oh my inherit God. all of my items? What? That's so cool. Yeah, it's part of the reason why NG is probably one of the better characters. That that seems yeah, it seems like that could get really busted. Yeah, so if then you again, stand right I'm between them, about. you get double the effect too. Wow. I will have my revenge, Beetle Queen. Oh boy. Yeah, we seem like we're stronger. 
Yep. NG is right. also, like, objectively probably one of the stronger as long as you never have to move. You can get both of those, by the way. Uh, the items near the teleporters. Okay. It makes it so if you take a ton of damage, Ooh. you go invisible for a while. That's That does sound good for me. Here, uh, check your... Watch your money. Watch your money. Okay. Uh, it works for both of us. Unless that was your beetle guard? Because I think uh, the beetle guard picked it up. Oh. I didn't know it could pick things up. I didn't think it could. But then I think it did. There's another one. Here, you go take that one. I'll watch my money. Okay. It totally did. Nice. Unless... Unless I got money from something else at the same time. <laughs> this is this is bad science. <laughs> uh, I, according, according to my chat, it's shared, so we don't have to worry about uh, oh, selfishly cool, cool, cool. absorbing money. Cool, cool. Okay. You can pick up all those coins, by the way. I have, so like, zero use for them. Uh, they're not meta what? progression. Uh, so the only meta progression in this game is just unlocks. Everything else is just uh, pure bonus. Uh, the lunar coins are used for... Uh, there's a shop that we can go to if we feel like it. Uh, I don't... There's like a, a thing you interact with that lets you warp to the shop. But you can spend okay. lunar coins on items with like heavy drawbacks, but heavy bonuses. They're hmm. weird. I usually don't touch them. Okay. Beetle guard has such squeaky arms, it feels like. <laughs> they're kind of bungee creatures. Yeah. They look like they're made of rocks, but no. They're made of Play-Doh. So how do you think about... Uh, what do you think about this game being 3D? Because I know that was, like, the big thing when they revealed it first. Everybody was like, it's yeah. going to be terrible. Um, I was, uh, I was excited about it, to be honest. <laughs> like, especially because when they revealed that, I was knee-deep in Ziggurat, so I'm like, yep. hell yeah, more, more of that that I currently am really into. So, I, I was for it, especially since I did like, I didn't play that much Risk of Rain 1, so for me, it's not like, oh, they're taking the thing I love and changing it. It was, hey, it's, maybe I'll like it now. Yeah. And I do think, like, I want to go back and give the first one a, a, ch a chance again at some point, but... The only like problem with it now. is you'd have to play it solo or local. It is not a game that you can do online very well. The netcode is so mm. bad. Oh. Uh, it's yeah. good fun, and I'd, I'd argue once you get used to it, Risk of Rain 1 is just a lot easier. But... Let's see. Ow. Are these healing 25 a tick? Dang. Let's see how much. Oh, yeah. I am still eclipsing you. I should stop doing that. Eh. I could also just, like, be be a little greedier. I, I mean, I should be able to... Well, I guess I don't run faster. I just can do, do shoots then. Are these, like, launch pads or something? Yeah. Yeah, these will just fly you to another ah, section right. level. <laughs> Get <down>. ah, <laughs> so close. Ooh, why is this one red? It's expensive. Oh, it's use items. Okay, um... I don't know how much you care. I don't know what the weird... Uh, the radio-looking thing summons a bunch of drones. Your voodoo doll might be better. Okay. Eh. I'll, I'll keep it. Let's see. Oh. Uh, not that it matters too much, but there's also things that let you scrap items that you don't want. Like a little machine or something? Yeah. Yeah, so you'll find them kind of scattered around. It's this pod-looking thing in the ground here. Uh, so if you have an item that is oh, just okay. not useful to you, or you have, like, too many wax quails, because that's inevitable, uh, then it's actually quite useful. Okay. 
For now, I'm just going to say nah, since yeah. I have no idea what's useful. And I don't want to just be like, so wonder, how's this, how's this, how's this, how's this, how's this? Uh, <laughs> what's eh. I mean, I'm sure there's a lot of people that also don't know, so it's not the worst idea. It's true. It's true. I, I noticed somebody in the uh, Wholesome Verse Discord uh, telling you how to inform people about uh, what items do in, in undermine. undermine. Yeah. Yeah. I made the mistake of forgetting in one episode that it was the beginning of a new series. Part four. And I will never live it down because I didn't explain it, what every single item did in that episode. Oh, I did it for the rest of them. And I won't hurts. live it down. I could get more I get bustling comments every fungus, day. but I shouldn't. I, I just long ago made the policy. I will explain what the item does the very first time I find it, and then after that, uh, there's probably a wiki. Yeah. I mean, because the thing is, what's weird is, like, I'm 170 episodes deep into playing Undermine on my channel. I've, like, 172. And, you know, I'm still getting comments that say, you know, read everything. But it's it, it's because of the uh, the 1.0 series took off way more than the other ones. So there's yeah, I was looking of, at that like major major congrats on that. Yeah, it's 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 really nice. The Neon Abyss and Undermine just popped off right at the exact same time. It's been wacky. Now I also started Fall Guys, and hopefully that pops up. <laughs> I would I would love to have a be a Fall Guys channel. <laughs> oh. Oh my god. Oh. The character, this character's a lot more fun as soon as I've like started to figure out more that I could, well, first of all, like being able to figure out I could dash upwards is really nice. That's real fun. Oh. Just blinking into the sky. That's really fun. I don't remember that being a thing. I don't know if it's good, but it's definitely fun to do. Uh, let's see. Just so I don't deprive you, there's an upper level with, I think, a couple more chests you might want to head for. Okay. I will right. go find the teleporter, hit it, and we'll get started. Hmm. That should work. Oh, shoot. You know what? I absolutely... Uh, you should come back. Okay. I'm I sent you maybe, on a fool's yeah. errand. I'm gonna. I'm in pain. Okay, the boss is over here next to me. Alright. The reason why this is a fool's errand is I forget. Uh, chests close uh, once yeah. the teleport has been activated. Just kind of wondering. Yeah, I forgot about that part. What is uh, this man's deal? Okay, uh, Imp Overlord is just kind of aggressive, whoops, and killing me, give me a second, um, he will teleport around, this is quite possibly like the worst spot to fight him, uh, he'll teleport around, he'll attack, he does like I think a beam, it's been a little while, uh, mainly just don't stand near him and he's pretty easy. Okay. Lord of the Red Plane. Oh, it's not a beam. He does, like, uh, spikes on the ground. That's what it oh, is. Okay. But mainly, you just gotta watch out for him just stabbing a bunch. Holy shit, did that... Okay. No, that... Killed my guns. What did? Oh. My thing? Uh, no, he did. Oh, okay, good, okay. Because I just threw out my, uh, my voodoo doll thing, and I thought I bungled something. Nope. I, I love your turrets. Oh my They're god. So nice. They let me be the terrible gamer I am today and not have it be a problem. I just get to sit in them and live. Oh my god, it's so much healing. That's so much. It's, it's so crazy. good. That's ridiculous. It doesn't protect you from getting one shot, but it yeah. uh definitely keeps the chip off. Yeah. Seems like we're probably not deep enough in to be one shot yet. Uh, let's see. Ooh. Uh I don't know what those do. Grab them both. I know the scythe is decent for you. I don't know what the other one does. So you can just have it. Shatter spleen. What? Critical Crits strikes always, always bleed, bleed enemies. enemies. Wow. Bleeding and enemies now explode. 
Nice. Yeah, so we'll just Yeet. get you all the crit items. All right. <laughs> I love just like the the standard stock ch cash money cash register cha ching noise for That's picking great. up the gold nuggets. It's really good. Okay. Couple of items up here that you can grab. Uh, let's see. Do I see any back at the start? Yeah, I do. Are they worth it though? The answer is no. Uh, okay. There's a three mushrooms thing in this machine up here. Uh, nah. Normally, okay. I, normally I would go for that, but a lot of my white items are actually quite good. Okay. What is this kind of, like, stun grenade sort of looking thing? It's a stun grenade. Is, is it a stun grenade? You'll, yeah, <laughs> you'll just periodically stun enemies. Sure. I feel like the the fact that you don't immediately get the item when you uh, when you select it makes me think that I've probably left items on the ground already. Oh, uh, like the fact that it drops it on the ground and not yeah. doesn't just give it directly to you. I feel like I probably I haven't seen some. any left behind. Okay, good. All right, did you get everything up there? Yeah. What's the crowbar though? Crowbar That's... makes it so you do more damage to healthy enemies. Oh. It's. It's useful for multi with the snipe upgrade, because effectively it means your first hit is really high damage. Mm hmm. Hmm. And which okay. one was the crit chance? That was the glasses, right? Yeah, you want the glasses. Okay. Yeah. No, and don't got any of there should yet. be there should be an item that kinda looks like a a hood. Uh made out or like a a wolfskin hat. With like the the head and everything, that one's also really good for crit builds. Okay. Oh my god. Well, let's see. There might be some other good crit items. It, they've massively expanded the repertoire, so hard to tell. Okay. Uh, let's see. So one thing I will say is I think this is the last level before the boss. So the, the, final uh, the teleporter might actually give us the option to uh, to go to the end. I don't think we're ready for the end yet because we need jumps. Multiple jumps? Ooh. Ooh. Like double jumps? Yeah. Multiple double jumps. Oh, okay. I made a mistake today. There's lots of bad boys over here. Oh my god. Yeah. You're right. Uh, we might not be ready for the end. That's where I'm at. Oh god. There's one bad boy that is following me shooting fire and oh, it's unpleasant. Yeah, I uh, I think I'm I got in a big old group of all of the people that you've made very angry today. Yep. Oh my god. I'm just, just trying to live. I'm staying the heck away. My turrets will do horrors to them and I will slowly get my HP back. Oh. oh my god. Yeah, these this fireman ain't great. Nope. Real real piece of work. I'm dead. Yep. yep. The little parade you made. I'm sorry. <laughs> it was I was like, eh, very we poorly. probably have a decent <laughs> chance. Like I'm I'm feeling pretty good and then just immediately went down to like no health and I'm like, well, that was Yeah. That was bad. You take it from here. I'm going to judge you. Okay. My, the real secret is, I don't fight them. My turrets yeah, that's do. That's true. I'm gonna, can I spectate your turrets instead? <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> to see the act, I can't. <laughs> to see the action. Oh my god, yeah, they're crazy. Ooh. Oh my god. Holy moly. Okay, holy crap, the uh, fire boys got bad. Yeah, they, I don't remember them jumping or flying like that. Like, that's new. 
Oh my god. He entered your house and destroyed it. He's a home record. Uh, didn't last long though. All right, we're good. Yeah. Broke down your little home. Ow. Your little home your home made out of cheese. Oh good, there's another one. <laughs> Do you attack like a like a scattershot grenade launcher or something? Yeah, I fire a bunch of bombs. It's part of the reason why the turrets are so strong is because my regular attack is so situationally not, not yeah. great. There he goes. Alright, safety zone done. Really do wish I could pick you up. I I realize why they have it the way it is, but it is Yeah. Just kind of tragic. It, like, you could Maybe if you just could like buy them from a from the drop pod or something, you know, where you you come in on this or something. Oh, pay back activating for the me. interactable summons a squid turret nearby. Yes. Ooh, what squid turret? Oh no, there's a squid turret. <laughs> nice. Yep. Oh my god. Everything is death. Yeah. Those, You're those running are on fumes there. Spooky. Oh boy, that grazed your buttocks. It did. I have right, summoned I, squid. Oh my god. I'm on a journey. Yeah, you're going all the way. I found the teleporter, which is terrible. <laughs> summon the bus. You can do it. I'm just gonna summon some extra squid boys. Yeah. Hopefully, I get multiple it squid boys. Okay. Do they? I wonder I, if they get your stuff too. Oh my God! Look uh, over on I, the left. You got a whole, you got a whole raid party with you. Yeah. Oh, it looks like they don't live very long though. Oh. Tragic. All right. Well, back up to Minimum full. cheese. Health. Health. Yeah, I was really hoping I'd, I just have like a, a bunch of squid yeah, boys it, just kind of hanging. It would have been perfect too, because it was all right by the exit. Right yeah, that's what I was thinking. Boss. That would have been amazing. Okay. Well, I don't want to make this take too long, but there's one chest I gotta grab. Go for it. Ooh. Oh my goodness. Yeah, these fire. So the, does the HP of the enemies go up over time on the level you're on? Yeah, uh, so every time you go through a teleporter, it gets a little harder, but it's mostly based on time. Okay. How, how long the run's going. Mostly that. Uh, let's see. So it should be over here. There is always a golden chest in a nook. Here it is. How much mm -hmm. are you? Whoa. Reasonable price. Rejuvenation rack. Doubles Double the strength, the strength of, healing. of healing. Yep. But you already heal your entire health bar every two seconds. Uh, yeah. But now it's only one that, second. That ain't enough. Yeah. Dang. The strength of healing done by. I wonder. Does that mean like the healing from your stuff to me too? I wonder. I. Not that. Well, I'm it's back working back. on my turrets. I'll. Yeah. But that doesn't necessarily mean anything. Yeah. I mean, that could be great. I could just stand in your turrets and maybe I'll have a chance to live. Okay. This is mistakes. Uh. Just grab what I can. I do not remember there being this many flame boys. Yeah, there's like a lot. And they have so much help. It's prob maybe it's just because it's a uh, uh, co op. Uh, I don't actually know if multiplayer changes much. Oh, really? I guess it's I kind remember. of inherently balanced by the fact that you only get half the items. And, well, in theory, half the items. I, th I think more enemies might spawn, now that I'm thinking yeah. about it. Cause, it would make sense. Uh, I don't actually feel particularly item anemic on a multiplayer run. Yeah. Okay. Trying to loot as much as possible. And I'll get out of here.
Okay, this will yeah. have to do. I think I think it would be neat if there's just like a very expensive way to bring back your partner. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, if I just had to pay increasing costs. Because it, it is yeah. it is kind of singularly terrible watching uh, one person run around grabbing all these items and you're just dead. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Maybe the easy balance would be you you get to keep all your money to the next stage. So you don't get that bonus EXP, but you can immediately just buy out a ton of things. Yeah. Or yeah, you could even just be uh could even just be like you take your own money like from yeah, from death. That that could be like to bring yourself back, to buy yourself back early like in a MOBA. Man, I forgot about that feature. Yeah. <laughs> I for I I uh like I I forget that I played so many what? hours. Oh. oh my god! Horde of many. Uh, if you say so. Wow, they are. Yep. Wow. Wow. Your numbers I, are big. As far as bosses go, this is actually probably one of the easier groups I could have run into. Is it done? Did you do it? It's over. I, that was it. That was all the bosses. My turrets are scary. Wow. Wow. I'm helping. Okay. In theory. <laughs> I'll uh, we'll we'll do the same thing. I'll just buy a bunch of items for you on the next round because I uh, I'm eclipsing you hard and that's bad. Yeah. I'm moral support. I I just don't want to do that thing. Uh, one of the first times I ever had the Risk of Rain one netcode work for me. Uh. We did like a three hour run where three of us were totally cool and like everything was stable and one guy was just dead from like minute one and just sat oh. there being like, can I get some items? And the rest of us yeah. were like trying to get him stuff, but he kept dying. And so eventually it was like, yeah, we just can't justify this. Yeah. He also probably didn't care nearly as much about dodging hits. So, you know, some amount of user error. Yeah. I, I, I know I know why I'm dead, and I know it's because I dodged poorly, and I don't have as much I, health. I think I needed to play the I think I need to play a character with more health. Yeah. I think, I, until I learn uh, what I'm doing. Once we get you the engineer, engineer is pretty durable straight from the get go, and then you you get red turrets. Mm hmm. You good? Yeah. All right. So I might have an option here. No. Hmm. How do we get to the end then? Or do we only loop if we kill the last boss? Because previously Maybe. it would give you the choice loop or go to the last level. Yeah, maybe it's the new thing. Sky Meadow. Uh, well, I don't know. Hey, Whole Rusty zone? Lockbox item. Hey, that one's good. Hey, oh, there's, there's a worm. I'm going to stay closer to you. I've never been here before. I don't even. I have no idea what I'm doing now. All right. I never have any idea what I'm doing, so it's all good. Oh, there's uh, all kinds of meteors that are taking my attacks, so that I don't get to shoot an enemy. Hmm. Um. What? Oh boy! I got oh. hit by a meteor and it launched me all the way, like. <laughs> okay. Into the pit. Okay. You can, I... Yeah, you can be hit by meteors. Okay, I got my Healy Fields down. Uh, give it give it a bit. Stand on the edge, yeah. not the fire bit, and that should be able to get yeah, you yeah, back yeah. up. There you go. I know that much. I, can I, I did enough raiding in, in MMOs to know not to stand in the fire bit. <laughs> I Honestly, to some degree, I say that for my own benefit, because half yeah. the time I will just go stand in the fire pit like an absolute dunce. Yeah. Green outweighs the red. It shouldn't matter. I have no idea if I'm doing anything, or if your your pets are all doing everything. Can't even tell. Uh, uh, eh. Uh. Doesn't matter. Okay, a lot of items around here. I'm gonna just start opening up chests for you. Okay. Right. We should probably not trigger the uh the shrine of the mountain. We could. Is that the little hand thing right there? Or? Uh, let's see. Yeah, the the three three claw shrine looking thing. That okay. makes it so we fight two bosses. We might be okay. 
Maybe. Wow, these are all great for you. Mm. That's the uh, predatory instincts. That's the really good crit item. What the hell are you? Crit super attack speed. Oh yeah. This guy looks like I don't know, like a butter monster from Earthbound or something. Oh man, I've never actually played Earthbound. I would like to. It. I just it's... want them to release it on like the Switch or something. Yeah, I think it's on <laughs> what, like the Wii U. I think it's on the uh, the Super Nintendo Mini thing. Oh my god. Ah. Oh my god. Oh my god. I just can't. I just can't live. It's not possible right now. Wow. Did you I just got, get... Yeah. Well. It's not possible right now. I'm sorry. It's okay. I'll, uh, I'll get better. Question mark. It, it really does... Yeah, I mean... For, for co-op, it is kind of interesting. Because... You, you die once, you, you're pretty far behind, which means you're going to get pretty far behind again, which means it's, you're going to get pretty far behind again. It's a bad death spiral. Yeah. Yeah. Like, Synthetic did it decently well where, like, yeah, you lose a little bit of money, but it's not particularly heinous. Yeah. But, like, the amount of, like, amount of time you literally just sit here is wild if you if you die. Cause that, that's what it is. If, if it was just, like, I was weak, but I got to, I could keep on coming back to play... You know? Yeah, yeah it's, it's a different story. But the fact that I'm I'm weak, I I sit here for a while and then I come back and I'm weak as hell. It's hard to get better at the game. It would almost work. Oh, you know how like you have the little uh, orbital turrets that fly around shooting stuff. Mm -hmm. It'd actually be pretty rad if like in death you just became one of those. Yeah. I would I I would love more things like that in games, just little in inconsequential ways that you get to still do something after you die, like you know like uh, like in Among Us we, when we were playing how you know when you die you still get to at least like go do around your do tasks yeah you get to go around and do your job. Among Us is also very short. Yes, the, that too. There's minimal consequence for loss because you almost always yeah. just get to go back and play again within a couple of minutes. This level is really big. Ah! Whoa! <laughs> Butter Boy. Butter Boy decides oh to say God. hi. Oh, boy. Wow. Butter Boy. Butter Boy is doing some pretty terrible things to my... Ow. Oh, me. my God. <laughs> to my me. <laughs> Yep. I don't have a whole lot of that uh, those swank regen items, so I'm I'm actually kind of reliant on being near my turrets, and uh, that ain't working. Let's see. A lot is of items around range? here. Uh yes, there is. Okay. It is non-fatal; like it normally cannot kill you. The okay. difference being. Uh, uh, the difference being in... Uh, hey, there it is. In one of the artifacts, you can make it so fall damage is completely fatal. I don't know mm -hmm. why you would want that. Yeah. But it's an option. It does nothing else but makes fall damage fatal? Yup. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, yeah. Double jumping seems... It's super nice. Very it's, useful? It's... It's like, you think, oh, it's just... It's just double jump. How can that change how this game plays? And the answer is, yeah, but now I have access to it, like, everywhere. Yeah, you can just... It seems like a very, very big deal. Like, you can get really, really high. You can get really, really far. Just pick up all the stuff in half the time. Hey, there's a healing item. So, I really should probably just throw the run. I'm just trying to find the teleporter. Yeah. I'll keep my eye out. Well, I mean, I wish I could keep my eye out by, like, sw swivel in the camera. I just Are you locked to my camera angle? Yeah, 100%. Oh, that's... That's not great. Eh. It's, kind of, it's nice in a way. I get to sit back and I get to literally do absolutely nothing. So in that sense, <laughs> it's kind of nice. But in, in a sense where, like, I could look around on a swivel and help try to find where the, uh, you know, the exit is. That would be nice. 
It'd be nice if it was an option to switch between the two, but maybe they don't want me to be able to help you find the exit for some reason. I don't know why that would be the big deal. Okay. Killing an enemy permanently increases your health. That sounds like something I Yep, should. infusion <laughs> is incredible. I was kind of baffled that we hadn't found one. That's a healing fruit on kill. Oh. Huh. Ooh. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not seeing it. There's one other place I haven't checked. This map is very big, though. It's large. Wow. Yeah, now that you're dead, we get all the item that you needed. Yeah, it would have been really nice. So how does that infusion stack? Uh, does it so increase the every, max that you get, or what? Yeah, so every infusion increases your... your uh, HP on kill up to 100. And so uh, I've got three of them, so I can increase my HP up to 100. Or per. Oh, so I guess, uh, you know, if my base health is 700, having three of those means I can go up to 1,000. It used to oh, be okay. way better. It used to be you just got like half a point per infusion. So if you just had like five infusions, you could just have max health by the end of the run. Mm hmm. Hmm. Where's this teleporter? Where's that oh! Sparkus? Teleporter looks different here. It's a Stonehenge thing. Huh. That would explain stuff. Oh! Well, this was a... Oh! I found it. Oh. Wow. Can you literally not get over there without a double jump? I don't know. Huh. Uh, let's see. Oh, that's not the teleporter. The hell is that That's then? not even the... Then what's that? Oh, that's a portal for the artifacts. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. <laughs> it's okay. even... It looks just like a big version of the teleporter. Oh, no. Oh, no. Judging, always judging. I'm trying. I don't have all the fancy movement speed tech. I don't have anything. I don't even have legs. I'm a ghost. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's that. That's it? Yeah, it must be. Huh. Now it's time for me to die horribly. Now oh, it's a magma, magma. Worm. I could, might actually be able to survive this. Maybe. Oh boy. oh, boy. This is a lot happening in such a small location. Well, I had a turret there. Nope, I didn't have a turret. Where am I going? How can you even anyone even see what was happening? <laughs> I Let don't. alone do anything about it. <laughs> oh my goodness. Just thoroughly lost. So as long as you're in that red circle that it takes up. Yep. The percentage, okay. Oh. Well, and I'm dead. Well. Do you wanna, do you wanna try going on a drizzle? Yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> I, I'm gonna I, I'm gonna go use the restroom really really quick. I'll yeah, right same. But yes.